This is Sophie Heller, and this is an ACT reading question. The question asks, if there are some zealous Whigs and Friends of Liberty in the provinces, the empire will be least likely to be reduced to a small empire if which of the following things happen. So we want to look in this part of the passage, and we see that um, if these people happen to be zealous Whigs, Friends of Liberty, remember all of that to their prejudice. So remember that they were Whigs and they were Friends of Liberty and use it against them and resolve to punish it. And it tells us that these principles, after a revolution is thoroughly established, are of no more use. They're odious and abominable. So let's look at our choices. Um, so choice number one, they're remembered and they're prejudiced by the empire. This is something that the passage advises us to do. So that's not going to be right. Uh, choice two, they're punished for their principles. Um, also mentioned in, in here, punishment. Choice three, punished by the empire after a revolution is already established. Um, that's also true. So... We're left with choice D, and that's um, not mentioned. So the Mother Empire remembers that after the revolution is already established, it may be too late to change. So this is not mentioned. So this is probably going to be something that's going to impede the empire to become a small one. So choice four is our answer.